Scaleboy Refractured is a 2.5D adventure game similar to Link to the Past and Paper Mario, right? Uh, you do have not necessarily an open world to explore. Uh, it does double back on some things. Not 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 so easily done as like a Metroidvania or like Link to the Past or any other type of top-down adventure game where you're kind of moving tile to tile and all that. Uh, this game is a little bit more linear and kind of it kind of shuttles you around through different uh, zones, uh, through different areas um, to have certain encounters. You have to solve certain puzzles and everything, like these dungeons and all that. Uh, and so far, what I've experienced, you know, initially I was kind of like, well, this is kind of, you know, milk toast. It's kind of like, ah, it's kind of just meh. It's all right, you know? Uh, but then the more I played it, I was like, wow, this game is like really charming. <laughs> and I could see, you know, every game, you know, not every game is for everyone, right? And this game, while it may not be for me long term, I could see this game being very successful if you have a significant other who doesn't play games or a kid uh, who you want to play games with and maybe you suck at games or something. Like, this, this is a great game for that. It has two-player uh, two player local. Uh, you can play two-player co-op uh, also remote if you have the if you use the uh, screen share, uh, remote share uh, Steam ability or Steam feature. So you can't play multiplayer on this if you want. Um, uh, I have a character here, 49 minutes in, not too long, but it was long enough. I was like, you know, I'm good, I'm good. I get, I get it, I get it. I think, I think I know who, what audience this is for. Uh, so yeah, I mean, if you're, if you are the significant other who doesn't, uh, who plays games rather, and let's say your your husband or your uh, your wife or your girlfriend or your boyfriend uh, doesn't really play games, but maybe they like to play games with you or something. You're looking for games to play with them. Like this might be a good title for that. 1999. You know, it's a good title for that. Uh, there's people in the review section who have like 95 hours in this game. There are others that have like 19 hours in this game. So there apparently are lots of collectible things uh, that you could get on top of just your regular. Be a regular adventure that kind of funnels you in. You can talk to all these characters. There's, lot, there's lots of dialogue. Oh my gosh. So necromancy is scary. That's why I'm sticking to the lances. All right. It's totally not because I failed Conjuring 101 or anything. Right here, this guy is the, the vicious guards of Sir Squarman. Squar Squarumon. Oh, Squarumon. <laughs> Have overrun the barracks. <laughs> Squarumon. <laughs> and our swords cannot penetrate their shields at all. Uh, if we had weapons with more impact, we could rush through them. But for now, dude, yeah, so there's tons of puns. Like, the game is... Uh, the game is pretty, um, pretty hilarious in that regard. <laughs> uh, let's try another guy here. Let me see. Uh, no one except the four squires themselves know where the headquarters lies in the house cleaner, of course. <laughs> he told me it's very close to the gigantic frame picture near the throne room at the end of the barracks. Oh, gigantic frame picture of the throne. Okay, cool. See, this is why you talk to everybody. Um... Yeah, this, I mean, this is such a, such a, a, a cool looking game aesthetically. Uh, can I smash these up? Let me see what do we have here. Ah, okay. Now, now you get your first lesson, okay, and how this game, uh, functions in terms of gearing. So, if I want to pick this thing up, there's, uh, there's two swords here. There's three swords here. There's, uh, uh, uh this guy's following me around. Smashing things up. Oh, I guess I was in his way. My bad. Uh, so if I pick this thing up here, Iron Blade! All right, put start. Okay, this is my Iron Blade. It says, when the kingdom got into trouble the first time, a very inexperienced blacksmith crafted a first version of a blockish sword. Now it's soldier's standard gear with a handy two-hit combo and long reach. I already have this sword. Um, so this is your gearing here, right? And the way it works is Scale Boy can pick up body parts and swap out his body parts for theirs, including your head. <laughs> Feet, torso, and head. Uh, <laughs> and then I think this is like hat or something like that, or glasses or something. Uh, but yeah, it, it's it, <laughs> it's a very unique gearing system uh, in that you know, for example, there's a Medusa head that will drop out of uh, out of the out of the rafters or whatever when you're in a dungeon, and it will land on you and replace your head. So it'll knock your head off, and now you have a Medusa head, and you start kind of running around like crazy. Your controls are inverted, and you have to try to make your way back to. Uh, and you'll slowly take damage and everything. Oh, look at this hay bale, for example. Let's go put that on. <laughs> oh gosh, I set them on fire. Okay, yeah, we gotta take those. We gotta take those boots off. Hold on a second. Those boots are. Um, is it these ones? We see cursed bone, like mysterious evil skeleton. Uh, lost them after an action-packed battle. Wearing them feels like walking on hot coals, and the footprints burn like ouch. Yeah. Um, can I drop them? I can't drop them. Okay, we need to find some new shoes. Stat. I see. I'm leaving a trail of fire behind. I thought it was pretty dope at first, but now I'm not really into it. Uh, let me see what's over here. Save the grand dice! Oh, snap. Oh, oh, dang! Oh, I set them on fire. 
Oh god, I'm, in a, I'm starting off. I'm starting off very poorly here. Let's go. go. I have a hold on a second. I have a club. Bam! Oh, smash! He didn't drop any body parts. Oh, that's a shame. Oh, he brought a club. I already got a club. It's fine. Okay, we have to find new feet. New feet. New feet. New feet. New feet. New feet in here? No. Smash! Smash! Smash all of the, all the vases. Everything. There's lots of things to uncover. Uh, all over the place. Uh, like I said, they did a good job really fleshing out this experience. Oh, hold on. Aim this guy. Gotcha, bitch. Now let's leave some fire behind. 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 He's like, <laughs> it does nothing. <laughs> Whoa! Tink, 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 tink. Whoa! Got him again. Oh, did he block it with his thing? Oh, shh. Okay, it's not looking good. I got it back. There's a setting for, you know, oh, I stuck on my own thing again. There's actually a setting for stationary. Um, let me see. I saw it last night. Stationary aiming. I'm going to turn that on. There's a relaxed mode, too, if you just want to, you know, go easy mode, I guess. Who'd want to do that? Hey, hey, friend. How? 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 Okay. <laughs> Let me see, stationary aiming. There we go. A little easier that way. Whiff. <laughs> Hold on, we're gonna try to sneak up around him. So I have not done this part of the adventure yet. Gotcha. Yeah, I've not done this part of the ad adventure. Um, uh, I've just been progressing slowly through the story. This is a bomb right here, so I don't want to necessarily hit it. Oh yeah, I can hit it. Sure, why not? Oh damn, why should you just hit that? This whole time. What's this thing do? Oh, it needs an arrow. Oh, whoa! Okay, well, how, how do I, uh... Yeah, I need, I need an arrow, but sure, but how do I shoot it? I guess I can't. Okay. Let's smash all this stuff up. Oh, gosh, I can! Oh, I'm gonna die to my own footprints. My own... On my own fucking footsteps. Uh, what do we have here? Buzz store. Dang it! Ugh! I really curse myself with this. Legit curse myself. Whoa. Open. Uh, is it locked from the other side? Dang it. Okay. Come on, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Oh man, this guy's relentless. Relentless. Do it again, do it again. Oh, dang, I thought it was just out of range. Ooh, new head. Helmet, you are a baddie now. What's to say? The Hell Knight's helmet, designed to be extra evil with horns, more life cubes, and everything. So, more life cubes, and is also, what is this plus thing here? What is it? This is my, oh, minus, oh, minus speed. So, minus footsteps, minus feet mean minus speed, I think. So, I move a little slower. But I get more health. So, I'm tanky, tanky boy, with a hay bale for a, uh, <laughs> for my, uh, body. Oh! Okay. Gotcha. Gotcha. Do it again. I'll do it again. Dang. Ah. Oh. Grab that. Come on, man. I need some new feet. I desperately need, need, need new feet. Oh, wait, wait. How does this work? Oh, it does. Oh, man. I thought... Okay, well, that's cool. Okay, let go. So yeah, like I said, like this is, like, you see the camera's kind of moving around and everything. You don't really have full control of the camera, but it makes sense as you're playing it. If you're, if, if you're jumping like single player or two player, like then it's like, okay, yeah, I can't have one person moving the camera all over the place. That would be annoying. Did they aggro? Nope. They're like, what happened? Okay, that was weird. <laughs> Just out of aggro range. <laughs> Now, I wonder if I can smash these things. I have a club, which is pretty good at smashing. Oh, it sure can. Let's see if we find anything in any of these. I'm looking for... Looking for love in all the wrong places. Come on, man. I just need... I'll take I'll take hearts or cubes. Health cubes. Anything. All right, let's blast these guys. Blast this dude. Take that. Oh, okay. This, okay, this time they aggro. Whoa! <laughs> Nope, 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 nope. <laughs> oh! Oh, did he block that? It looks like he blocked it. 
Do it to me again. I'll do it again. Yeah. Some health over here. See, I could sit here. I could sit here and smash everything. Oh gosh. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I am gonna smash everything. I need health. <laughs> Lock me on the other side, dang it. I can't believe these stupid feet. That's gonna be my undoing. These dumb feet. Okay, this thing these things I can smash. Lots of these things actually. Oh, what is this? New body? Oh, new feet. Oh, soldier's boots. Oh, good. What is this thing? Royal tunic for the grandest. What is this? Only members of the Knight's Order are allowed to wear this strength-inducing piece of armor. But I guess we can make an exception this time. <laughs> cool. Well, we got some more health. That's always good. Uh, I actually lowered the uh, the the um, uh, music about... Oh, this thing is... Like, look at this. I can't see where that aims to. <laughs> um, I, lowered the, I lowered the music just a smidge because it was just a wee bit too loud. It's pretty. It's a pretty demanding. Oh, hmm, look at this. It's a pretty demanding soundtrack. Like it really demands your attention. It's really hard to explain this, but uh, um, a lot of background music. It kind of sits in the background, but this one has such a full range. It's very like in your face, and um, I can't make that jump, can I? Hmm. There's definitely something here, though some parkour business uh and so i lowered it just like a smidge and that helped kind of sit in the background a little bit so that way i could still hear all the action and everything and i didn't have to worry about um hold on a second can i can i use this to shoot this thing down oh look at this dude yeah see see like i said it's a well thought out game <laughs> of course, I mean, it's it's such an obvious thing, too. It's just like, of course, of course. But, you know, you, as you're playing the game, you're not really sure exactly what, what the developer intended for you to do. Like, sometimes when you play a game, you try to figure out, like, is this something the developer intended, or am I supposed to actually parkour this or whatever? Uh, but no, nah, man, it is it is exactly what uh, what's the obvious, <laughs> which is just shoot it down. I can break these things without this. I don't need this. I don't need this, man. I'm gonna get my own health. Um, blue, blue, blue. Wow, lots of health. Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. I saw the, I saw the horns. Lots of health here too. Yeah, yeah. See how much easy this is? Where I'm not like burning myself every two seconds for my foot, feet. My burning feet. There's another guy down there. Look, he's trying to hide. Get out of here. Get out of here. Hold on a second. Okay. I see this. So now every time I see one of these, I'm gonna think that there's like. Secrets to be had. Oh, whiff. Get out of here, dude. Whiff. There we go. Okay, good. Oh, the arrows are still pointing. <laughs> oh. Oh, man. I have to do the other one, too. Come on, tell me I can make the jump. Oh. Dang. Wait, wait, wait. Come here. No, definitely. Oh, oh gosh. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, let's do this. Right there. Yeah, right there. Nope, oh, okay. Mm -hmm. There it is. We can just ignore these guys, I think. Smash everything to bits. Lots of health. Oh my gosh, tons of health. Also, just some damage. Let's grab this. Whoop. Make way over here. Yeah, I just did a dungeon. The intro, the intro was pretty like lots of uh, uh, you know, just kind of intro dialogue and everything. Kind of introduced, the, kind of explained who you are. But at the same time, didn't. Um, I ended up disguising myself as a princess because I found her hair, her wig. I put it on, and they're like, "Oh my god, it's a princess!" And I was like, "Okay, that's weird." <laughs> oh great. Am I really supposed to? Hold on, no, I have to make this. I have to actually jump this. Oh, okay, no. Okay. <laughs> I was a little worried about that. Uh, I, oh, I see. There it is. This thing here. Okay. Um, and then the next, and then immediately it lunges me into a dungeon. And then after I after I finish the dungeon, I kind of prove prove myself. Uh, I prove myself to the uh, to the guards that I, I'm not just a skeleton that they need to worry about because everyone's being attacked by monsters. Oh, this guy's this guy's going ham. I know they could do this. Oh, get smashed. Hmm. Got him. Got him. Got him. Got him. Look at this. Oh, oh, he's dazed, he's dazed. Oh, what are you trying? <gasps> Ooh. Heavy armor. Wow. Oh, fire protection, but minus frost protection. You know what? That's fine. I don't think I've really seen very much frost anything. Cool. Oh, 
armor, it says. Like, hell armor? Yeah. Helmet? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I, I see the trend. I get it. Um, let's go ahead and hit this thing. It probably does nothing now, right? Nope. Okay. They hit this thing. I hope that's what I'm supposed to do. And there's one over here. Oh, <laughs> oh, it made a hole in the ground. Yeah, yeah, that's where you gotta go. Smash, smash. Just health. Yeah, it's gonna be just health. I don't think the odds of me getting a piece of. Oh, here we go. Now we're actually back where we started. So wait a minute, then. Where do I go? Uh, let me see. Is there another way that I've not yet gone? Oh, this way I've not gone. Oh, yeah, definitely not. Whoa! Okay, well, there's just nothing here. I want a shield? Hold on a second. Can I get this guy's shield? Come on, come on, come on. Good. Oh, man. Alright, I already did this. So now I gotta figure out where to go next. This has happened to me before, actually. I missed something. Um, in the dungeon, I had to do like a big old lap around everything. Um, ah, this, this, this thing makes you go really slow. Two of these things, it's really, really slow, and I can't just take them off. Alright, next, we're, we're gonna swap heads, because this is not worth it. <laughs> the speed decrease is brutal! Oh, come on, Chonky! Come on, Chonky! Kick around some health cubes. Uh, give me, give me, give me some head. <laughs> give me some, you know what I'm saying. Nope. Whoa. Oh. Okay, come on, there's gotta be... Did he drop his head? Nope, he did not. This guy's not gonna drop anything good for me anyway. What do you drop, though? Soldier's boots. Oh, there we go. Soldier. Well, I already have soldier boots. <laughs> Didn't help me at all. Chonkers, come on. Oh, oh, hefty. So hefty. Ooh. All right, let's see what we missed over here. Oh, let's get this thing here. We'll get this back. Oh, thank God. Okay, now I can run a little bit faster. <laughs> All right, so we can't jump off this, so we do have to go down here. Oh, what the heck am I missing? Okay, we'll drop down. Oh, God, it's right here. Son of a... That's cool. It's a little tour. You know, just, like, just take a second. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, smash these things. Oh, dang it! Of course. Oh, I move so much faster though. But she does damage, so we got it. We got to get the head back. Get my head back. I think she does damage right over time. Yeah, all the controls are backwards, so you don't want that. Stab, stab. <laughs> so there's that Medusa head I was telling you guys about. Uh, what do we have? Uh, boots and armor. Okay, I'm good. Whoop. Smash! Ooh, one-shotting! One-shotting! Oh, 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 Got him. Is this soldier's boots? They are, okay. Lots of bombs in this right here. Let's go and smash shit out of it and see what happens. Oh, no, nothing. Okay, can I pick him up? Bomb. Oh, I have a bomb head. <laughs> the version of the bomb is called the Red Boomblebee. And in comparison to its smaller variation, it's not as fragile as and is much easier to move around. Okay. So, like, whatever. I got my speed back. So I'm good. Oh, hold on right here. I'm cracking the wall. Uh, how do I how do I use my head? <laughs> oh, I move so much faster without <laughs> Let's get the bomb head again. <laughs> Oh, man. I'm telling you, man. Like I said, it is charming. <laughs> Definitely a fun one, like, to play with a kid or play with someone who doesn't play games, you know? <laughs> Just explore these dungeons and get ahead. You know what I'm saying? It's the best thing to do on a Friday night, which is stupid other. other. Let's make this. Oh, oh, okay. Just checking. Just checking. Okay. No. Boy, you don't know. I'm a bomb head. It's a shame it does damage to me. Okay. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Perfect opportunity to use this. The zombies. They have a poison attack, so. 
stay. They're pretty easy to dodge, so we just gotta stay a little bit. One more smash, I think. Oh, two more smash. Three more smash! Jeez. Was there no one over there? There was. They drop body parts too, but uh, they all, uh, like, you have poison resistance and such. Oh, great. The axe don't hit the Y button. <laughs> I figured the Y. Well, now I have no head. So we'll have to go find one. Oh, hold on. What? What? Oh, it's this thing over here. You can fall, by the way. The game isn't gonna necessarily just hold your hand across this whole thing. Whoa. They have a- Oh! Well, you know what? There's health down here, so it's probably a good thing. They have a sonic scream that can stun you. So you gotta be a little bit careful. Oh, look at all this health. <laughs> it's a good thing he dropped down, actually. I'm so glad we're not moving as slow as we were. This is ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. But the resistance and everything was pretty nice. Oh, there's somebody back there. Ha! Huh. Rip. You could just, you just stay right there, man. Oh, wait, where's this go? Oh, it goes to... Ha, ha, ha. We just found another way, I guess. Nope. My character Shadow doesn't really show up when I'm jumping here, so... Uh, not over those little planks, it didn't. I swear. Oh, this looks like we're going into a fight. A boss fight. Smash! A little more health. Here it is. And right here, too. If anything else you want to give me. Is this guy important? Hold on, let's just clear the room a little bit. Trust me, this is going to benefit us. Dunk done. Hold up, was something over here? There was. No, there is. Can't go this way. Okay, we can go this way. <laughs> Look at all these half, half, half height walls. <laughs> There's gonna be a gun fight here somewhere. Ooh, a pumpkin. Cool. Pumpkins are dope because they give two shields. Hold on, was there another... is there another path here? No, no, it just goes back to where we started. We can't jump over this wall anyway. We can jump down to that one. Oh, we can jump... okay, well... Yeah, a lot of, in a lot of cases, they don't let you just kind of like... just willy-nilly just jump off of things. But in this case, yeah, there was a place to catch me, so... It's fine. Was there another, uh... route down here? There is some stairs. Okay, hold on, there's a whole other... Did we open that door? Does that just... oh, that just takes us back to the... uh, to the beginning, so when we die, which our checkpoint is super far away now... Um... Then that's where we're gonna go. There should be a checkpoint or something, man. This is a long time without a checkpoint. Oh, uh oh, is he gonna? Okay. We're gonna one shot him. Oh, 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 oh. oh, he still got me. It's okay, I have a shield, so. Dang. He's gonna get on it. I gotta get him quick. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa, dang! Oh, oh, they took two, two hits. Oh, they blocked one. Okay. Smash, smash, smash. Try to get some health. He's gonna man that thing. Nope, 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 nope. He's waiting. He's waiting. Okay, that's cool. Plenty of health back there. Can I get from here? Oh, I smashed the thing! Perfect. He didn't know what to do. He was dumbfounded. He's like, what happened to my crossbow? To my ballista? Okay, well there goes my, um, stomach pumpkin thing. <laughs> my shield. I missed. This guy doesn't know what to do. Whoa! Too easy! Too easy! What is that? Some soldiers' boots already got them. Ah, here it is. Now, now, now I'm certain we're some, we're getting somewhere. Hey, Bale. 
I look so stupid. <laughs> no. Okay, hold on. Are we, are we coming back? Is this the way we came? Oh, jeez. I'm just zooming right now. Now we open this door from the other side. Okay. And there's my regular head. Which is cool, but... Cause, wait, did we open another? This is just a path to get back, I think. Let's go back up to where that... Um, there's definitely a path that we've not yet explored. Is it dining hall? We only went to dining hall, didn't we? Not, there's not a lot of smashed things here. So I don't think we went this way. <laughs> I didn't, there's no trail of destruction. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> we've not been here. Lots of health. Cool, cool, cool. Ooh, some alchemy stuff. Ooh, the banquet hall. It'd be a shame if somebody... Okay. <laughs> Not quite the destruction I was hoping for. Take that, turkey! Uh-oh. Oh, we got some red ones. I haven't seen those yet. Oh, god! Okay. Okay. Can I get that spit ability if I get their head, I wonder? Hmm. I bet I could. I mean, the Y button is your activate your head. Your, your, uh, helmet. Or your, I guess just your head, really. I'm just, I'm just skipping. I'm just knocking over things. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, there's a path right there, but we don't know what's over here yet. <laughs> just kind of, like, jump over everything. <laughs> skipping all these baddies, I'm out. <laughs> this is the proper way to play. Speedrun strats. Here we go. My stupid little... It's a, it's a hay bale with a bomb head. <laughs> it's a bomb sitting on a hay bale that walks with a club. What's over here? Throne room. I, I'm willing to bet there's probably a baddie over here. Let's do this. Oh, yeah. Oh, the camera tells me there is. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Take a sip of coffee. We're going in. <sighs> oh. Grandis, Grand Dice Fluffy Beard. Hey, ps, hey, who might you be? An enemy, a friend, or whoever you are. When I look into your eyes, something seems strangely familiar. If you are here to save me, be careful. There may be this upsettingly stylish villain with a red scarf nearby, and also... Uh-oh. Dun -da -da! Oof! Oh, you now carry a huge burden! Oh, great. I didn't have to pick that up, did I? Wait, what's this? What's this? What's this? <gasps> oh, snap. These little cutscenes are so great, too. Okay. Oh, boy. Okay. My first time facing this guy. Let me see. The crown of the Lord, it holds a mysterious power. It's not flowing through. Yeah, but what does it do? <laughs> okay, let's stick to something. Uh, okay, he's, is he gonna... Is he gonna... What is it? Ice dancing? I know this ability here. Big squares. Oh, they twist this time? Oh, my gosh. Oh, get out of here. Uh-oh. He's gonna, he's gonna throw these things. Oh, they bounce off walls, too. Sick. Please be nice to each other. What? Where'd that come from? Ha ha ha! Oh. Okay, we just gotta stay out of his way while he's doing his business. Oh! Oh, what are these ghosts? Please be nice to each other. Oh, that's the... Oh, the ghost blow you down. Careful with the ghosts. Ding, 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 ding. Here they go. Ding, 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 ding. I like how the camera stays focused on the on the boss like this. Ooh. Okay, now he's gonna launch this thing. Oh dang. I'm in a bad way. I can't activate my bomb because I'll lose health. Oh, the whiff. I guess when he's stuck like that, I can't hit him. More of these. Whoa. Explode. He's still. Oh, oh, I just fall apart, my poor guy. Very, very, very Mario. <laughs> okay, where am I? Oh, right here. Let's do this again. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Who am I? You uh-huh, uh-huh. Now he's gonna come down, he's gonna give me- Take another sip of coffee, that's what I was missing the last time. Not enough sips. <sighs> Alright, we're doing this, and then we're out of here. 
<laughs> All right, let's give him some space. Let him do his thing. For three runs, then we go over there and we strike. Then we get one attack. He's gonna do this. I'm, gonna, I'm actually in my club. Very stylish villain. There we go. Get some good smashes in there. Oh dang! Yeah, one more, one more slide. You're way over there, dude. One, just one hit. No charge. Oh, that was close. Now we got ghosts. Slow ghosts. Whoa! Good. Good, 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 good. Watch out for these ghosts. Okay, they're gone. These are pretty easy to dodge. Yep, yep, yep. You're gonna, you're gonna move the second I get over there, so. <laughs> Don't try and play me for a fool, man. Here we go. Big smash coming in. Oh! Did I do damage? I don't think I did. Look too slow. Oh! Help. Okay, one more skate. Okay, 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 okay. Some gear. Oh wait, wait a second. There's a lever right there. I just noticed that lever. I can make it to that lever. That doesn't do anything. Oh dang! Just keep the deeps on him. Deadly. De oh boy. Whoa. Well, that could have been that could have been it right there. Did he drop his backbone? What is this? Cursed rib cage. Ooh, a source of unspeakable source. What did that give me? Uh, even between so minus luck, I guess, and <laughs> dark power pushes danger away from you. Oh, interesting. We'll drop this guy. We'll get a little happy little cutscene. I'm floating in the air, I guess. Ho ho ho! You hit that mini square in the jaw! Thank you for saving me. I was confident this would be the last dance show I'd visit. And I didn't even have any popcorn. Ho ho! Excuse me! The shock over my kidnapping is still deep-seated. I never thought Sir Squatterman, my court magician, would be capable of such horrendous actions. And then he sent his henchmen to use me as bait for Princess Zoletta. Luckily, you came first. You are a hero. Maybe THE hero! Ho ho. Ho. To be honest, I feel very bad about this. The four squires always told me that Squatterman was up to no good. What a shame. I, the Grand Ice, should have known better. Dun, 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 dun. I was smuggled down in my throne when I when a red light flashed from the graveyard. I'm afraid that there, of all places, is where Squatterman controls the undead. It's where the old hero, you know, that one, drove an evil horde of monsters back to the flip side about 400 years ago and brought peace until now. It's horrendous that he used this place as his headquarters now. Is he gonna want his, uh... So there's, there's no way we can do anything here. Onwards to the barracks, friend! Is he not gonna ask for his, uh, hat back? Let me get some air, young one. Okay. Don't fret, just follow me. Okay, cool. We'll follow this guy. We're just, we're just, uh, yeah. Okay. Let's go follow him. We can use the dumb waiter. Clever, huh? Oh, hey, that's kind of clever. There we go. What's going there? Whee! <laughs> All right, so there you go. The game is called Scale Boy Refractured. Like I said, it's a very charming and very well thought out and well designed game. Um, you know, there's a little rough edges here and there, but honestly, like you know, camera stuff mostly. But honestly, like it's pretty damn good. Like it, this, this is. It, it's 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 not for everybody kind of game, but it's certainly welcome to my nightcap seller. Oh great! Oh, there's a checkpoint right there. Bam! Got it already. Uh, so definitely something to check out if you are looking for something to play with. You know, like I said, somebody who doesn't play games very often, or maybe you're just looking for a fun game to play co-op with somebody else. Uh, I could see this being a fun one. And like I said, there are people who are putting in like tons of hours into this title. So I heard the game is short. I don't know if short when you're when you have 95 hours logged. 
or 19, even 19 hours logged. Uh, I mean, 19 hours for 1999, that's pretty good, especially for a cute little adventure like this. Um, but that guy with 95 hours, I think that guy is just fucking crazy. So thank you so much for watching. My name is Mike B.A.K. Phony. Pick it up right now on Steam, $19.99, Scaleboy Refractured. Thanks for watching. I'll see you.